Burning Man founder Larry Harvey D.I.S. after Ma. Dots of stroke. Burning Man founder Larry Harvey died Saturday weeks after suffering a massive stroke. Harvey started Burning Man on a San Francisco beach in 1986 and over the years it became a notorious annual event in the Black Rock Desert of Nevada inspired by art and the symbolic burning of a giant wooden man. After his stroke earlier this month, Harvey was hospitalized and got around-the-clock care. We resolutely held out for a miracle, wrote Marion Goodell, the Burning Man Project's chief executive officer, in an online tribute. If there was anyone tenacious, strong-willed and stubborn enough to come back from this challenge, it was Larry. Though we all hoped he would recover, he passed peacefully this morning at 8.24 a.m. in San Francisco, with members of his family at his side. Harvey, 70, has remained heavily involved in Burning Man which draws tens of thousands every year to the Black Rock Desert, about two hours north of Arena. More, Burning Man founder Larry Harvey hospitalized after massive stroke he is responsible for the creation of the annual theme and naming the streets in Black Rock City. He also contributes to the design of the event's central effigy, burned on the penultimate night of the week-long event each year. While the event draws out those seeking meditation, art or those wearing neon and listening to pumping music, it all is centered around ten principles, which Harvey created. He said he wrote down the event's principles in a cafe in Mexico in 2004. The principles are purposed to encourage burners to have a more fulfilling experience of the event, they include radical self-reliance, inclusion and self-expression. He's told several versions of why he thought to build a man and burn it on a beach in 1986 including once when he told a reporter jokingly that the figure represented an ex-girlfriend. It didn't, but the prank still lingers as false legend. In recent years, critics have lambasted Harvey for making Burning Man into a money-making scheme, and also for making the event into a massive, organized event. Others consider the long-winded, philosophy-loving leader somewhat of a guru. Goodell said Harvey was never into labels because he didn't fit a mold and was 100% authentic to his core. For all of us who knew or worked with him, he was a landscape gardener, a philosopher, a visionary, a wit, a writer, an inspiration, an instigator, a mentor, and at one point a taxi driver and a bike messenger, she said. He was always a passionate advocate for our culture and principles that emanate from the Burning Man experience in the Black Rock Desert. She said his death was a great loss for what became a movement, but it wouldn't slow them down. The loss of his presence in our daily lives will be felt for years, but because of the spirit of who he is, we will never truly be without him, Goodell said. Larry would be the first to say this isn't an ending, but the start of a new chapter and we all have a hand in where we go from here. Contributing, Journey Kane, Reno, Nevada, Gazette Journal follow Crystal Hayes on Twitter, journal underscore crystal.